hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel and in this video i will show you to use button element in elementor so you can see this is my wordpress website and now let me open elementor editing mode and after that we will be able to use elementor elements So before adding elements we need to add a section so here we can add a new section and next just click on plus icon and after that here we are able to use drag and drop features so just select button and leave here so after that these are three tabs content style and advanced so let's see how we can customize this so th this is type option by default and next if we select these so you can see info success warning danger so you can see these are various types and after that we can change button text like submit and next here we can link like for example we can give here upper link all right and after that if you want to use this option like dynamic tags so you can also link anything like site URL okay after that this is alignment option so you can align center right or anywhere so next this is size option small extra small medium large so whatever you want to keep this is up to you okay after that you can add icon also you can upload icon in SVG format so for example next if you want to select any type of icon from library you can easily do that so you can see and after that you can select icon position before or after so for example if you want to select this so you can see this is looking very beautiful and if you want to remove just select none so after that here you can use button ID you can create any type of ID and you can use for this is required for coding purpose so after that we can go on style tab so the first option is typography so let's see here you can see these are various options so this is font family you can select whatever font you want so you can see here font is changing and after that this is button size whatever you want to keep so next this is also for text you can change like bold or keep it normal or default then you can transform text into uppercase or leave it original also this is style option so you can keep it normal or italic or so also next this is decoration if you want to underline or overline so let's see you can see we got a line over the text and after that this is line height so you can see how it works so next this is letter spacing so you can see and this is word spacing but at this time this is only a single word so next after that so this is text shadow so you can increase or decrease all right and after that this is text color option so if we hover over you can see color remains same but if we want to change so before that here you can see this is normal color and next you can see this is hover tab we can go here and change color like whatever you want 
and background color so let's see so in this way how our work works so if we add a border like so you can see here how it works and after that this is for our animation so you can use animation function so next this is for radius for example if we add 30 so you can see this got rounded and the next option is padding so you can add like 20 so this is a gap from its positions to center and I hope you got all options to use Elementor button element so thank you for watching video for more videos and updates please subscribe my youtube channel